Hello engineers, welcome back to Engineering Design Simplified. In this video series, I will be solving tough engineering mechanics problems. If you want to watch more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel and press that bell button so that you will be notified when I upload a new video. Today's problem is a roller of weight W equal to 1000 LB rests on a smooth inclined plane and is kept from rolling down by a string AC as shown in figure. Using the method of projections, find the tension S in the string and the reaction RB at the point of contact B. So here a roller of weight W equal to 1000 LB is uh, placed here and it is uh, kept from rolling by a string AC and it is making an, at making an angle of 15 degrees with this inclined plane and the inclined plane is at 45 degrees from the horizontal. So in this problem we need to find uh, the tension in this string AC and reaction of uh, this plane at B using method of projections. Now uh, let us see in the coming slides how to solve this problem. This picture is redrawn here. Uh, weight W is acting downwards and string is at an angle 15 degrees from this inclined plane. Let us draw a horizontal line here passing through the center of the roller. So this angle horizontal from the inclined plane is 45 degrees since this is 45 degrees. So this angle between these two uh, lines will be 180 minus 45 degrees. So let us call this angle theta. So you, uh, some of the angles in a triangle equal to 180 degrees using that fact we can calculate theta theta equal to 180 minus 180 minus 45 minus 15 degrees so theta equal to 30 degrees so this angle theta equal to 30 degrees now let us see forces and reactions so this roller free body diagram of roller is drawn here since we have found theta that is a uh, angle between AC and horizontal is theta that is calculated in the previous slide and also written here theta equal to 30 degrees. So tension in string AC will be making, at an, ang making an angle theta from the horizontal and acting towards this direction. So that is shown here. So angle between horizontal and T is 30 degrees. Weight W is acting downwards and reaction force at B that is RB uh, is going to be perpendicular to this plane and will be passing through this. So the angle between horizontal and RB will be 45 degrees since this is 45 degrees. So this is the free body diagram of the uh, roller. Now let us uh, transfer this force and reactions to XY plane. On the XY plane we have weight W acting downwards. RB is uh, shown like this and it is at an angle 45 degrees from horizontal. Tension T is shown like this and it is at an angle 30 degrees from horizontal. We are going to use method of projections to solve this problem. Now let us resolve forces along X direction. Along X direction sigma FX equal, equal to 0. That is sum of forces along X direction equal to 0. So along X direction we have RB. The horizontal component of RB is RB cos 45. That is equal to T horizontal component of T is T cos 30. So we don't have uh, W won't have any horizontal component since it is vertically downwards. So here we get RB cos 45 equal to T cos 30 and RB cos 45 minus T cos 30 equal to 0. Let us call that equation 1. Now let us resolve forces along Y direction sigma F Y equal to 0. That is sum of forces along Y direction equal to 0. Along Y direction we have uh, vertical component of RB that is RB sin 45 and vertical component of T that is T sin 30 minus W is acting downwards minus W equal to 0. So from equation 1 uh, we can write T equal to RB cos 45 by cos 30 let us call that equation 3. Now let us substitute equation 3 in equation 2 we get RB sin 45 plus RB cos 45 sin 30 by cos 30 minus W equal to 0. So after a simplification we get RB equal to W by sin 45 plus cos 45 into tan 30. So after substituting the value of W 
and simplification we get rb equal to 896.6 lb now let us substitute rb equal to 896.6 lb that we have calculated in the previous slide into equation 3 so we get t equal to rb cos 45 by cos 30 equal to 896.6 into cos 45 by cos 30 after simplification we get t equal to 732.1 lb that's all for today's video if you like this content please like share and subscribe thanks for watching